Hey guys, this is Tina with Tina's Inspired Art. Hope you all are having a great day today. Thank you for joining me. Today we're going to do a Dutch pour, another one. Um, <clears throat> on this canvas, it's an 18 by 24 inch. It's got the one and a half inch depth um, gallery wrapped. So it's a high quality. I love these canvases, Artist Loft canvases. I love them, they're my favorites. Um, so today we're gonna do something a little different, um, something new and fresh with my style. Um, we are going to use a gray. I mix this gray, this is my interior base paint that I like to use, but I. I mixed my white with just a little bit of black to make that nice, beautiful shade of uh, like a nice soft gray. And then I'm also going to use the white as well. So a nice split um, canvas, canvas today um, for my design. I'm going to probably <clears throat> kind of take this part of it and do it a little bit maybe maybe I'll split it like this have this gray on the bottom and then white on the top so I'm gonna get going with this covering my canvas so we will put this in fast forward mode um, and then we'll come back and we'll talk more about what we're gonna do Hi everyone, I'm back. I flooded my canvas. I've popped my bubbles and I think we are about ready to get this going. I'm excited. Today will be a little bit different. I always like different as you have been watching me or if you've been watching me, I just like to be a little different. That's all. And today I think we are going to continue that trend of being a little different. My colors, my color palette for today is going to look like this. I'm going to start off with a black, go in with a, and that's, this is by Liquitex. I'm going in with, after that, a black blue by Pebio, a silver, by Liquitex, a iridescent blue by Pebeo, and topping it off with a gold by Pebeo. So we are going to have some shimmer in here, um, some depth, and some dimension and style. So I look forward to what this one is going to look like. So stick with me. Let's have some fun and we'll see what this looks like. I'm going to pop just a little bit more bubbles before we actually begin. I see a couple surfacing. I wanna get those before we begin. There we go. And guys, I just popped my bubbles instead of with a, a flame. I do have one, but I don't like to use it on my base interior paint. I like to pop them with that, it's an embossing gun. It heats up at the end and it's very quick, just enough where it doesn't cause a lot of fumes. So that's just what I prefer. Let's get started. See what we're going to do today. I think I'm going to start with kind of one going like 
this and another one like this. bit of a hinder there but I can pull it out kind of like to pull those things out of the sealed but I do that and Okay, so that's my black. I'm going to go in next with my Pebeo. Um, this is the blue black. Yeah, it's coming out the way I need it. Sometimes you just have to get those clogs out of there. Everybody's having a good day today. Feels like a good day today. Me yesterday. Here we are in the end of January, and it was in the 70s yesterday. Low 70s, but crazy weather. It's like, I'll take it. Went for a beautiful walk with my dog, Atlas, and he was in heaven. He loved it. Typically, he only likes to go, or he only lasts about one lap around our neighborhood. But yesterday, he was in the mood for more, so we did more. It was gorgeous. Gorgeous weather. And the colors on here are looking so pretty. I'm actually wondering if I, I don't think today I'm going to add the gold like I thought I was going to. Or maybe I will. I don't know. Let me think about that. I just did a blue one yesterday. It came out gorgeous and it had silver in it. And it had greens in it. If you remember, in this one, no, I think I will. I think I'll add the gold just on the tops, not on the bottom. Kind of like it blends in. I'll do it like this. Low. Just putting it up at the top of these, having it transition. Just 
Let's get the top. Mm -hmm. See what that looks like. So just the maybe even an ear bubble right there can pop it. Pop, pop, pop. Ooh, that looks pretty, guys. So far, I'm liking this. I think it's gonna look good. Let's get going with this. Okay, I'm ready. Ready to have some fun. Get untangled. This is the blow dryer that I use. It's a little flower by Drew Barrymore. I got it um, at Walmart. And I love this one. go guys that so far I'm liking the uh, colors look really well together I'm liking how it blew out probably hard for you to see it um, I am now going to go through and 
play with it a little bit. And I can see the cells popping. It's, ooh, it's looking good. It's like, it's like transforming as we are standing here with the cells just popping up here and there. Oh my goodness, super cool, little clusters. All right, let me get my little towel and let me proceed with some, some interest in this pour. There's no real special way of how I do this piece of it. I just look at it and say, hmm, what does it need? So that's just part of the artistry in doing this part, part of the process. I can see the uh, shimmer from the silver is really, really pretty. Quite amazing how it's just shimmering. find my hand shaking today. Must be the coffee. The gray split makes this a little more interesting, that's for sure. It does look pretty cool. Look 
think I'm going to go through this process and do my thing. It's probably hard for you to see what I'm doing, but I will take you down for a closer look when I have completed this. Okay. Hi guys, I'm back and I have finished the embellishments on this one and look at it. I think it looks super pretty. I hope you agree. I hope you like it. You've got the split gray white background and I've layered this piece starting with black went into a blue black to a silver a an iridescent blue and then gold on top and i only put the gold more at the tips of each row so you can see that it's kind of transitioning I think when it dries, it's going to be even more amazing with the shimmer. So I hope you like it. Let me know in the comments if you do, if you want to see different colors. But this is going to be amazing. I can't wait till it dries. Look at the cells popping out on that. It's just amazing. Another successful pour. I'm loving it. Let me know what you think, guys. Check me out on my Facebook page, tinasinspiredart.com. My website is www.tinasinspiredart.com. I'm also taking commissions for the next few weeks. So if you want something specifically done for you in your home, let me know. We can talk about it. Send me an email at tinasinspiredart at gmail.com. Love you all and thank you for subscribing. I really appreciate your support. And I'll be bringing more videos on a weekly basis. Love you all. Bye for now.